Hello, my loves. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make a custom watermark on an app called PixArt for free. You want to start out by going on PixArt. This is exactly what it looks like. Then you want to click on this plus button. It will take you to the editing screen where you can start to edit. You want to scroll to the very bottom where it says color backgrounds. Click on the checkered pattern. It will then take you to the editing screen. Then you want to click on tools. Once you've clicked on tools, click on crop. Then crop it to your desired liking. You want to have it perfect for a watermark. I used my cropping for a logo. Here's my cropped piece. Then you see many options here. You want to click on text. Write your name or your channel name, whatever you want to write for your watermark. Then you want to size the wording to your desired liking. You can see there are many different fonts that you can write in. I don't know how to pronounce it, but the font I used was Bunya. You want to click on the circle for colors. Pick a color. I chose texture and in texture you can choose many different types of colors. I personally chose the paint pattern. You want to click on the T with the outline around it to choose your outline color. I chose black because it makes it stand out. In case you want to give your text a blurry effect, there's the gradient effect. Change the size of your outline with the amount button. my finished text. I scroll through to see a sticker button. Once you see the sticker button, click on it. I clicked on it. It'll take you to a search screen. You can choose any of the most popular stickers or you can search for one. It shows this rainbow ring. You can then size it to your liking. I wanted to make it look like a border, so this is what I'm doing. This is me after finishing sizing the ring. Add any extra effects, stickers, or even draw. But I simply chose this. After doing this, you just have to click the turn button. Then go to Kinmaster. Click on Layer, then click on Media. Click on the folder called PixArt, then click on your personal watermark. Size your watermark to wherever you want to place it in the screen. Preferably place it on the, on the bottom of the screen. After you've done that, you can size it to the entire ratio of your video. Trim and split however you like. This watermark will be clear and won't go through anything. Now I'm going to enlarge in the size of the video and simply add my custom watermark that I use for my channel. There it is. I'm going to add it to the bottom of the screen and then size it to my liking. Here I'm just trying to show the camera what the watermark looks like. I don't know what I was doing, but this is just extra. Here's the finished watermark. Anyways, bye guys. Have a good day or night. I love you. And please be sure to subscribe and like.